Hey my loves, welcome back to my channel. Today I have this Instagram post trend makeup tutorial that I've been seeing everywhere on Instagram and I decided to do my own for you all. So let's get started with this. I'm first starting off by color correcting under my eye. Next, I'm grabbing my aphrodisiac eyeshadow palette that Urban Decay sent to me and this is my very first time actually playing with the palette so I wasn't sure what the colors would look like. But spoiler alert, this palette is awesome. The first color I'm using is Whiplash and I'm applying it to the crease of my eye. To blend out the crease, I'm using glare and just feathering it out to my brow bone. Next, using the shade Night Fever, I create a light template for the Instagram post shape I want. Using my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer, I'm applying a base to my lid to start forming a cut crease. I wet the tip of my finger and go back into Night Fever to apply metallic finished eyeshadow to the inner corner of my eyelid and then tapping it out to the center of my lid. With a small flat brush, I fix the edges of my cut crease. Now going back into this beautiful palette, I'm grabbing the shade Addict and applying this to the outer corner of my eye. I'm also going to lightly blend this over the crease area as well. I smudge the same color along my lower lash line using an angled brush. Next I'm using my Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Pencil in the color Rockstar. I tight line my bottom and top lash line. To emphasize my eye shape, I finish lining my eyes with my favorite illustrator brush eyeliner from M Cosmetics. To clean up under my eyes, I apply my Shape Tape Concealer and blend it out with a beauty blender. Next, I'm using my Fit Me Dewy Foundation in color 330, and I'm only applying this to the area in which my Instagram post is going to be. Next, I'm using NYX's Roll-On Shimmer and applying it to the same area I apply the foundation to. Now for some details. I'm using NYX's Vivid Brights Liquid Liner in color Vivid Blossom and applying that to my crease, starting from the inner part of my eye and working my way out. I also lightly line the flick of my eyeliner. Oops, I almost forgot my brows, so to fill in and shape my brows, I'm using Total Temptations by Maybelline. Now, going back in with Vivid Blossom and Vivid Petal, I create small dots along the area of my Instagram post. I'm just playing and getting creative with it, so have fun with it. Next, I'm spraying my face with Face Mister to create a moist surface for my glitter to adhere to. FYI, if I was actually going out with this look, I would use glue instead so that it lasts longer and the glitter doesn't fall out. For the inner corner of my eye, I am using eyelash glue to hold a few pieces of this blue confetti glitter since there are larger pieces of glitter. And of course I need to add lashes, this is an old one that I have from House of Lashes. And for a final touch, I'm using this floral embellishment I found at Michael's and I think it's absolutely adorable. Now that we're done with the makeup, we are ready to clean up our Instagram post shape and create our Instagram post headers. I found that painting the straight edge of a card and then pressing it alongside my skin helps to create a straight line. And to give it more shape, I'm creating this drop shadow effect by lining the square of the Instagram shape and blending it out. Guys, it's not gonna come out perfectly straight. I even tried really hard and it still came out a little bit sloppy, but we're gonna roll with it. And for the final icon details, you can draw them in with the black liquid eyeliner, but I decided to just go ahead and Photoshop them in when I touched up the photos. And here are the final touched up photos. What do you guys think? Looks pretty cool, huh? The unedited version doesn't look as cool, but the actual makeup and the, I love the floral adhesive looks pretty dope. Let me know what you guys think. Comment below. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching. And before you go, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell so you get notifications every time I upload a new video. Until next time, remember that you're absolutely beautiful. Bye. Mwah.